God being our father can never be a partaker of anything evil, of anything bad, of anything that brings dishonor to you as his child. The joy of God is when he sees you as his child prosper and do well. It brings him glory. And I always say when I minister that anything that happens in your life that is good, praise God, you give glory back to God. Hallelujah. We read from the book of Luke chapter 3 and verse 22. It states, And the Holy Ghost descended, shaped like a dove upon him. And a voice came from heaven which said, Thou art my beloved son, in thee I am well pleased. For you to be able to experience the benefits of a relationship with God, the Father. God has to be pleased with you. Praise God. I want you as I speak to you to look back and reiterate in your own lives. Is God pleased with your work with him? Is God pleased with how you are relating with him? Is God pleased in your service to him? Is God pleased in how you handle your marriage? Is he bringing glory unto his name? Praise God. When Jesus was being baptized, God the Father released a dove upon him and he says, I am proud of you. I am a, I'm proud of you as my son. I am well pleased with you. When God looks at you as a praise and worship leader, when God looks at you as a pastor, when God looks at you as a deacon, a deaconess, is he pleased with you? Is he pleased with your work? Those are some of the things that could hinder us from receiving or walking in the blessings of God in perfection. Is God this morning pleased with you? Praise God. Reiterate upon your life and realize how do I relate with God? Is my relationship with the Father pleasing to him? Really, you're the only one who can tell yourself the truth. Hallelujah. If your relationship with God the Father is not pleasing, then the benefits that are supposed to flow into your life will be or can be limited.